Hi boys and girls, happy Friday. Today, I want you to listen to the story, a new story I just bought, called The King of Kindergarten, written by Derek and Vanessa. Looks like they work together on the words and the pictures. They are the authors and illustrators. The King of Kindergarten. Oh. It looks like he drew a crown on top of his head. Oh, that's right, kings wear crowns. And it looks, hmm, it looks very royal. Oh. The morning sun blares through your window like a million brass trumpets. It sits and shines behind your head like a crown. It does look like a crown on his head. Mommy says that today you are going to be the king of kindergarten. You'll use a golden brush to clean ye royal chicklets. That's a silly way of saying your teeth. You'll wash your own face with a cloth bearing the family crest the symbol of the family. You'll dress yourself neatly in hand-picked garments from the far-off villages of Osh and Kosh. Bagosh! You'll be ready to reign. That's a joke. Osh, Osh, Kosh, Bagosh. It's a type of clothing, and that's what he's wearing. And garments is a fancy word for clothing. And reign means rule. He's ready to rule. My baby is heading to school, mommy will say during breakfast. But you're not a baby. Could a baby wolf down a tower of pancakes the way you can? I don't think so. You're growing up so fast, daddy will say. And he'll be right. I can't stay the same size forever, can I? He'll say. One day I'll be taller than you, daddy, and you'll be my little man. Daddy will laugh but you won't be joking. Then a big yellow carriage will deliver you to a grand fortress. The carriage is the school bus. Like the horse and carriage in Cinderella when there's royalty. There's his royal bus. There he is, the king of kindergarten. As you walk up to the towering doors, you'll remember mommy saying, hold your head high and greet everyone with a brilliant, beaming, majestic smile. For you are the king of kindergarten. So I'm gonna zoom in. There's all the people. There he is looking at his reflection and oh, I see a crown on top of that king's head. And I like what mom said, so let's do that. Hold your head high. Hold it up high. And greet everyone with a brilliant, beaming, majestic smile. So hold your head high and let's see your smile. Wow. Your royalty. Your teacher will welcome you with a warm smile and a friendly good morning. She'll be delighted by how you recite your name with pride. Right here it says, welcome to kindergarten. We did this virtually on the computer or tablet or phone or whatever you're using to get on our online class. When you head, um, when you head to your royal seat, the kids at your round table will wave and say, hi, like they've been waiting on you all summer. So you'll smile back and return the wave and give them a cheerful, hi everybody. The truth is, you couldn't wait to meet your kindergarten kingdom either. When you are royalty, you have your kingdom. That's like where everyone lives. So this is his kingdom, his classroom. Your teacher will, whoop, your teacher will go over classroom rules and you'll all discuss important matters such as shapes, the alphabet, and the never-ending mystery of numbers. She'll even read a book about trucks, trains, and tractors. Phew! 
It sounds like a lot, but you're the king of kindergarten. Piece of cake. You will show your bravery at recess when you go up to one of your classmates and ask, Marie, do you want to play with me? That is so, so brave. That is so brave making a new friend and asking them to play. Not only will she say yes, but she'll lead the way in helping you save the kingdom by battling a fire breathing dragon. he was brave he made a brand new friend in the cafeteria the boy sitting next to you will be missing dessert you'll have packed your favorite chocolate pudding with an extra cup just in case so you'll say to him want a pudding Howie he'll say thanks and you won't mind at all because what could be cooler than sharing with new friends? That is so cool. Sharing is caring. It says, be awesome. We are kind to each other. Yeah, sharing that is really kind. And you know, when we are in school, when we have snack or lunch, if someone forgets something like that, the teacher will make sure they share because we have to take care of our friends, making sure there's, they're not allergic to anything. But sharing other things is super great too. After a royal rest, at the end of it, your teacher will wish you all a magnificent evening and bid you farewell Ooh. until dawn means the next day. On your way back home, you'll think of all the things you can't wait to tell your parents. I made a bunch of new friends. My teacher is nice and recess is the best thing ever. There's his crown again. The sun crown. And tomorrow, it will begin again another day as the charming, the wonderful, and the kind dot, 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 King of Kindergarten. Give it a round of applause for the King of Kindergarten. All right, my kings and queens, because we can't forget them, I want you to think how you are like the king of kindergarten. Maybe you're like the queen of kindergarten if you're a girl. I wanna hear about it. How do you feel special? How do you feel strong and brave? How do you feel important when you're in our room? What makes you feel like you are also a king or a queen? I can't wait to find out. All right, I'll see you later.